All right, Brian, thank you. A manhunt continues in Metro Detroit today for a suspect accused of killing his own mother. The deadly shooting happened Monday in Inkster, and police say a warrant for Joshua Hill's arrest is now in the hands of the prosecutor. 7 Action News reporter Darren Cunningham spoke with neighbors now on high alert. While state police say the vehicles Joshua Hill is believed to have been in had been recovered, investigators say he is still unaccounted for and should be considered armed and dangerous. Abandoned houses all over, you know, where could he be hiding? Where is he? Those are questions Michigan State Police are desperately trying to answer. Where is 25-year-old Joshua Hill? Teresa McNay, who lives on Glenwood, next door to the Hill family in Inkster, says she's known the family for nearly three decades. Monday, state police say Hill shot and killed his 64-year-old mother. Just kept to himself, just kept to himself. I can't even imagine what could have transpired next door for it to result in that type of ending. Lindell Thomas, who says he's only been in the neighborhood for three weeks, lives across the street. That's what's scary, the fact that you could take the life of your mother, man. As a, you a man, I'm a man. We, we all come through the channel of a woman to get here. And the fact that this man took his mother's life. We're out there actively. It's a manhunt. Michigan State Police Lieutenant Mike Shaw says Hill is believed to be on foot in the metro Detroit area and is six feet tall, about 170 pounds. As for why he allegedly committed this heinous crime. No motive yet. Uh, we need to get him into custody and sit down and have a conversation with him. It's just very fearful. We've been sleeping with the doors definitely locked in the living room. I'm assuming he knows everybody in this neighborhood is looking for Josh. Lieutenant Shaw says if you see Joshua Hill, do not approach. Instead, call 911. If you have any information, you can leave tips at 855-MICH-TIP or call Crime Stoppers at 1-800-SPEAK-UP. In Inkster, Darren Cunningham, 7 Action News.